prayers are with the Virginian people that were trapped on those icy roads. Uh, a lot of people for hours on end. And it's supposed to be more snow coming there. You know, you just never know what these conditions and what people have to go through and to endure. And um, I used to live in Virginia. I used to live in Hampton, <clears throat> as a matter of fact. And I remember being in that Virginia, in the Hampton Roads area between the Anupa News and Williamsburg, etc. It wasn't a lot of snow, but it would shut things down. It'd be enough where things were, you know, uh, you know, you couldn't cope and function at that particular time. And but to see these conditions with how you saw people trapped in their cars and you saw people trapped on the air am tracks and different places, it was really sad and tough. And um, people missing loved ones and you know it's just a really it was a cold hard scent to to see and um, you know it's really puts a lot of perspective about how you know when you're looking at um, through the weather and through what you have to survive. And how these conditions can be just so unbearable and just not right. So I want to take the time to send thoughts and prayers. And hopefully people who are going through that in Virginia that, um, you know, it'll be things will be better. Because that was very extreme, very extreme and uh, sad, frightening and just unbearable to the, to the mental psyche. So. I want to just acknowledge that. Prayers and thoughts. Please hit the like, subscribe, welcome thoughts and comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And we're only a month in the winter, so we don't know what's going to happen. But just keep people in your thoughts and your prayers. I'm out.